Capricorn, welcome back to the channel. It's me, Antonio, here, back with another tarot card reading for you today. We're going to be using the Hoodoo Tarot deck today. Receiving messages from your spirit guides, your ancestors, those that came before you, your overall spirit team, to see what messages they're wanting to relate to you today. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, add value to the channel so that we can continue to grow, allow the message to spread. There's a lot of work to be done. All right. So let's see what the message is before we get started with your reading today. Let's see what's the grounding energy. All right. So grounding you today, Capricorn, we have Aunt Caroline, the Wheel of Fortune. All right. So you may be some type of gambler. You may have some type of opportunity coming towards your way, an opportunity to invest, uh, an opportunity to expand as well. Um, a lot of options here is what I'm getting. Right, and we're getting Ace of Sticks, which would be Ace of Wands, Creative Talent. This could be uh, sex coming in. This could be mm, a lot of creative energy coming in to help you produce, um, to put forth your artistic talent. This is like a lot of energy coming in here. We're also getting the grandchildren here, which is the star card. This is uh, Aquarius Major Arcana. So definitely child, uh, a child coming into fruition here or um, childbirth. Uh, this could be children involved in some type of way. I'm not sure what I'm getting here. Um, inspiration. Some type of highlight. Maybe children highlights. Not sure what I'm getting. Getting seven of knives here. There's definitely confusion. Exactly. I can't really pinpoint what's going on here. There's information or inspiration being hidden from the youth. This could be um, institutes trying to take away inspiration from the children, which would be song, which would be art, dance, and things like that. But we have Aunt Caroline here. So this may be an opportunity for you to come in and provide these things for the collective here. Maybe you're some type of content creator uh, building towards the future, laying some type of foundation. Mother of baskets here, showing your nurturing, your empathic uh, abilities as well. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, again, song, dance, um, artistic endeavors. This could be baptism as well. Bapti baptizing children for whatever reason. Four baskets. <laughs> uh, a neglect of the emotions or a neglect of, um, yeah, the artistic habits of children. This is like stifling the creativity of the youth here. Ace of Sticks is creativity. This is a burst of passion, inspiration. This could also be sex as well. This could be some type of painter. What else are we getting? We're getting four of wands with uh, the four of baskets as well. So silencing the emotion, silencing the thought of the youth, silencing, trying to silence the future here. Hmm. Let's get a more clear message from your ancestors and your spirit guides. See what they're having to say about this situation here. Son of Knives. This would be Page of Swords. Hmm. Immature activity. An amateur writer. An amateur thought provoker here is what I'm getting. Right under grandchildren, which would be Aquarius. Ace of Coins. New opportunities to make money here. So this could be some type of... It's almost like someone is about to take on the burdens. I'm, not, I'm guessing that's you or someone around you. Maybe you may need to help this individual. Someone is about to take on the burdens or um, of what's happening here. Like someone's trying to stifle the voice or the creativity of the youth. And someone's about to get ready to take leadership uh, to um, meta this situation. Now this could involve Facebook that just changed their names to Meta. Ace of Coins, yeah. They set some new type of precedent, some type of new idea, some type of new name. They're rebranding themselves. We have Ace of Wands and Ace of Coins. The future, grandchildren, which Aquarius would represent the internet, the World Wide Web, eccentric ways and eccentric habits of, uh, of 
eccentric thought patterns and thought forms, which would be the internet, because that's not regular, right? Someone had to create the internet. The typical or average would be having a conversation with someone face to face or pen paling someone, but the internet changed everything and flipped everything on its head. This could be cryptocurrency. This could be an online course or class to teach people about art or teach people about their heritage. And then we're getting nine of uh, swords. Hmm. Yeah, again, mental anguish. People are being held back. People are losing sleep. The words are being stifled here. This is a lack of mental inspiration here. Even children. Um, I'm getting the school system. <laughs> it's not what it used to be. Daughter of knives, yeah. Knight of Swords. This is a harsh lesson. A harsh lesson learned here. This is going to be new institutions being uh, needing to be developed here. So the old school structures, which would be known to some people as the school to prison pipeline, not providing the youth, the children, with um, adequate or accurate resources here, we're changing things. So yes, yeah, someone is definitely taking on. Whatever um, whatever action this is, it's like someone is taking, I'm not sure if it's justice, or they're taking teaching and learning into their own hands to provide an opportunity for the youth. We have ace of sticks and we have ace of coins here. Someone's going to become very financially abundant. Like, really? And the whole part. Purposely trying to bounce it. This is what children do. This is why children need homework. And need to be trying to learn something new every day instead of wasting their time on a basketball court thinking that they're, become, they're going to become the next athletes. But like, share, subscribe, add value to the channel as we continue to grow. Catch you on the next one. Peace.